my god. What's up, guys? We are back. Gold is a resource. Oh, um, yes. Oh, oh, yes. Uh, I, I possess no ill intent. I, I assure you. Uh, I merely wished for a closer look at these bows. Oh, really? But those of other races differ so in design from our own. You see, I cannot deny I am curious about them. Oh. That's all it is, mind. Uh, curiosity. Uh, I have no desire to actually own one of these contraptions myself. Uh, mm hmm. And even if I did, it isn't as if I could purchase one. Wait, I think I got a bow. Hold on, bro. I'm going to go get you a bow that I picked up. You know, sharing is caring. You know what I'm saying? Perfect. Hey, buddy. Yeah. These foreign bows do so intrigue me. Yeah. But I shall admire them from afar. Stake it. You would simply give this to me? Bruh. Oh, that is most generous. You didn't I grab anything, though. Accept it. Uh, <laughs> you have my gratitude. No problem, buddy. We're good. Fascinating. Tis not dissimilar from an elven bow in make, and yet tis unlike one in near every respect. Mm. My aim has suffered of late, such that my wayward arrows simply would not strike true. The timing could not be more unwelcome, as my skill with a bow is to be put on trial anon. Right. Forgive me. I should not expect you to know of our ways. I, I speak of the trail of archery, a time-honored elven custom. Every elf undergoes this trial when they reach maturity. Till we succeed, we are not considered to have come of age. Huh. Say, would you be willing to give me a demonstration? Okay, change vocation, archer. There we go. Go to the equipment menu, yes. Oh no! Robin Hood is here. Let's go, guys. Let's go. Let's go help out the elf. Do a little good deed before we actually go and uh, finish the, you know, main quest. Looks like it's going to be a way to go. I can't believe they made us change into a freaking archer <laughs> for us to be able to do that quest. All right, let's see how archery works. I nearly did as Bop, bop. Oh, brother, this guy stinks! Hello, hello. Oh, they're hunting boars. How dare you. Attack. I just realized something. We should have got a mage. <laughs> I don't even know what I'm doing. Hopefully we don't As a see anyone. Fact. That will actually Every master I've ever served Oh my god We should have never come here We trouble The thing is man I don't know if we can beat this dude would allow us to save us Oh there he is all over there He's fighting people Come on let's go Oh! We went prepared. I'm level two with the archery. I'm gonna come back and kick your ass as my mage. Run, people! Jesus Christ! Run, guys, run quickly! What's attacking us now? Oh my God! Surprise! Quack. I'm literally just getting one shot right now because I've died so many times. Retreat! Man. Hello. Hey, buddy! We got our ass kicked to come and teach you how to use the bow. Who? Oh, true to your word, you have come. Yes, I know. But it was not worth it. Let us begin at once. Um, I, I should like to observe your form first and foremost. Uh, uh, so, so stand here and take your aim at yon targets. Right. Here we are. Like this? No, you should. Try! You have my gratitude. I learned much from you just now. Did you? In fact, 
I have made a discovery. Right. Unlike those of Elven make, bows crafted by other races are designed for keen aim. Is that not so? This is no revelation for you. I expect you thought this design common to all bows, yes? Yeah. Not so for those of Elven make, however. Our bows are crafted to guide not the hand, but the heart. Yeah. Mayhap you will find the sentiment strange, but such is the perspective of elven kind. Okay. We are taught that arrows loose to a proper form will strike true, as if it is all a matter of poise. Right, okay. I admit, I find it rather baffling myself. Perhaps that is why my bowmanship has failed to improve. Yet with this bow, I begin to understand. Let us see if I fare any better now. Okay. Huzzah! What a feat! Oh yeah, you good now? I can hardly believe it. Every last arrow found its mark. Dead center. Well done, man. This marvel is, is nothing at all like an elven bow. The design allows for ease of aim and steadfast flight of each arrow. To think that I should I should feel such a difference. Mayhap I am more suited to a bow of foreign make than one of my own peoples. <laughs> it is a strange thought, but how else to explain it? My arrows have not soared so true in all my days. Right. I'd nearly given up on myself. Yet it would seem I am not without talent after all. My performance of this bow has divested me of such doubts. But the ingenuity of this design, if only my people would take heed. It is all very well to talk of honing one's form, but why should we not perfect the tool so integral to our customs? Yep. I am decided. I shall take this bow back to the arbor. Right, I'm not going to get into crap because I gave our design to elves, am I? With this as my weapon, I have no doubt pass my trial of archery. It seems so. 8,500 gold. I should be glad to assist you. Yeah, I want to uh, change my vocation back to my mage, please. Let us proceed to the... Boy there, friend. Care to help a fellow out? Um. All I ask is that you hear my request. What have you got to lose? Yeah, what do I got to lose? Let's find out. Hear him out. My thanks, sir. As to the matter at hand, it concerns my ox cart business. Okay. I've been holding off service on account of all the monsters on the road, but now I feel prepared to start making trips to Mel again. Oh, yeah. Yeah? Only trouble is, there are still monsters about, and I can't help but worry for the safety of the carts. That's where you come in. See, I've got a letter here from Lady Margit, the watchhead's wife, to be delivered to one Sir Leonard in Mel. Okay. I'd like you to accompany the cart in my stead and see to it that the letter reaches its recipient. What say you, friend? Yep. I agree. Splendid. I knew I was right to put my faith in you. Oh, and I'll pay your fare this time, seeing as you're doing me a favor and all. That's what I thought, buddy. That that's more fair. Yeah. More fair. Come find me when you deliver that letter. I'll be waiting to hear from you. Alright. I can fly as well now. I can fly, look. Oh <laughs> Let me see how many people I can enchant this with. So you? There's a wolf coming, by the way. There you go. Bye-bye, <laughs> wolves. Ooh. Oh, shit! One guy's dead. We could add a warrior to our ranks. What say you, master? 
Their mighty attacks could easily swing the tide of battle in our favor. I know, but one dies dead, guys. It looks like there's a little town here. Only problem is there's this ah! head up there. I quite agree. We're here, Master. Oh. Protect the shipment. Steal yourselves. Cut the things down. Don't let them touch the shipment. How did this happen? We must defend the cargo. They're a tenacious lot. I thank you for coming to our aid. You are certainly that was welcome, a tight bro. Tight spot you saved us from. Hey, stop the waving. Uh, Hello. Hey, look search. at me. I pray my efforts aid your cause. Let's get going. This way, master. Okay, let's go. Watch out, Carrie. Burn. Boom. Are you kidding me? Run, Conan. Ow. Run, Jinx. Jinx. Come on. Wait, 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 wait. This game is crazy. Fuck ah. you. Oh my god! Jinx! It is perilous here. I recommend a swift retreat. Yeah, no shit, Sherlock! Go. Come, come with me. Carry no! I'll carefully conserve my strength. Shut your fucking mouth! Bob Jinx. There we go. Yeah, it is, buddy. Here's some heal. Please don't hit me. Burn! Right. Boom. Right in your ass. Come on, you're not climbing. <laughs> Bow. More power! Boom! Yeah, buddy! It was a trial indeed, but one we surpassed with skill. The tide of battle was in our favor. Yeah. Yeah, biatch. Yeah, I remember we still got a Minotaur for us to go kill. Let me see how far it actually is. Oh, yeah, he's all the way up there. Huh? We ain't going there. Screw that. This ox cart's bound for Mel. I'll need to see some coin before I let you on. The guy said he'll pay. Oh, we here. Thanks, buddy. We are in Melv again. Water cart melts and see Margit's letter to its recipient. Hmm? Oh, what does this say? Leonard. Forgot where you were, bro. There he is. No, that's not him. I, what can I do for you? Oh, it is him. Hello, Leonard. I got, I got something for you. There you go. Ah, a letter from Lady Margaret, you say? Yes. It's a fair way you've come, then. My thanks. Mm -hmm. She's a kindly sort, I must say. We met when I worked with her husband, Sir Gregor, on one occasion. Now she's taken to inquiring after my health at the turn of every season. Is he? Huh? Making our report ought to be our next priority. Let's go explore this little area since now we got all the power we need for us to destroy everything. My knowledge I feel like from other worlds tells me that a forgotten riftstone lies near here. Where? Oh, hello. One can see. What is it? Got a question about my training regime? What? Well, I don't even I know you, bro. That was an unlikely guess. None took to the training like you did. Open to enlist, then? No. A pity. 
I'd hope to add you to our ranks. You'd seem like you'd be fit for battle, even if I were to call upon you on the morrow. Which is more than I can say for the rest. Hmm. Apologies for assuming. We've had fewer folks looking to enlist of late, and I'm hungry for recruits. Right. Many keep their distance on account of the instructor being a bistrum. A very Vermundian of them. Well, but I'm a bistrum the as well, least, bro. I'd like to provide some decent training to the soldiers we have now. Easier said than done. Especially when the weapons we were promised have yet to arrive. Tisn't like to boost their morale having rusted steel to train with. Hmm. What I wouldn't give for some decent weapons and a soldier to act as an example. Someone with motivation to grow. That'd light a fire under them, I reckon. Mayhap you could aid us. I know tis much to ask of anyone, let alone a stranger, but what else am I to do? Hmm. Pledge your aid. Much appreciated. We'd welcome what you can spare. That's nice. Just oh, here. Looks to be a good spot for harvesting ingredients. Shall we see if there's all to be found while we're here? No. So I need to go find motivated soldiers. Have you any weapons for me? Uh, I did. <sighs> I guess I can buy three sword for you. This ox cart's bound for Burnworth. Yep. I'll need to see some coin before I let you on. I know, buddy. Here. Come on, guys. We dozing off. Don't have time to wait for this dude. Oh shit! Hello. And Alf, come on. Look at Gandalf flying. Come on, brother. Fight. One more, one more, one more. What? Alright, okay, 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 okay. And he's dead. Bop, 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 bop. Can I climb him? <laughs> oh, oh. Why? Why did I do that? Run. Bye, buddy. Whiskers is fifth on. Fifteen, buddy. Fifteen. Nice. Done it. Ah, you've returned. Yep. How did you fare on the Not bad, you know. Not bad. It wasn't that bad. I've delivered the letter. You've been an immense help, I must say. You've certainly earned a reward, my friend. Here you are. Thank you. Ox carts, 5,000 gold, miners, Hossen. Oh, yes. Love it. Come on, then. That's it. I've had enough. Clear off. And don't come back till you're ready to do business properly. Uh-huh. What's going on here? But I've got the coin. I swear it. I simply just... That's the kid that the guard was running after. Where is it then, eh? Bring the coin, all of it, or I'll call the sentinels on you again. Are we clear? Tis uncommon for a lad of his age to be un- mm -hmm. Hey! Oh, tis you. You're the good sir who aided me in Mel. Yes, I am. How are you doing? Thank you again, sir. You don't know how grateful I am to you. Oi, sir. We've started selling that medicine you gave me at our shop. Ooh. Why don't you come see? Okay. Where? Where's your shop? Oh, his name is Grandalf, not Gandalf. Hello. Well met, sir. Forgive my presumption, but were you the one who gave my granddaughter that medicine in Melv? Yes, I am. I thought so. <laughs> She's not stopped talking of her adventure since she arrived home. Oh. You have my sincerest thanks for aiding her. That girl's always running off on some fool's errand or other. For all my chiding. Once she gets an idea under her bonnet, there's simply no talking her out of it. Now listen, tisn't much, but I'd fain offer you a discount on my wares. Pray, make good use of it, won't you? Uh, 
Welcome and well met. Don't think I've forgotten your discount now. I'll knock a few gold pieces off for you by. So spend away, my good sir. Let's have a look. What you got? Ornate box. 20% discount? What's that? Something small can be stored within internal compartment. I might buy it. It might come in handy. Ornate box. I've brought you. Oh, damn. I didn't even. Sorry. Who just give me? Oh, well. Thanks. No clue what it was, but thank you. Oh, tis you. You're a welcome sight. Yeah. Forgive my boldness, but I've a small favor to ask of you. What? Would you be willing to lend me some gold? I swear you'll be repaid in full. Huh. What do you need it for? A trinket in yon shop caught my eye. A small, ornate box of exceptional craftsmanship. Alas, twould seem I do not have the coin on hand to purchase it. I can certainly procure the gold later, but by then, the box might be gone. If you'd be kind enough to lend me the amount I need, I would repay every last coin. Right. Here, take it. You... You bought it for me. Thank you. Well, I just bought it. I'll treasure this. No problem. You're a kind soul. Pray, let me return the favor someday. Uh, we'll see. Now I'm starting he to think. a young man of decent character. I believe his promise to repay your kindness was a genuine one. I don't know, bro. We just have to see. So now we're going to go back to our quest that we've been trying to do for 10 years. Onward. Our work is not yet done. Oh, is that what she gave me? Yeah. Ah. Oh, shit. Let me charge it. Boom. Heal. Get some lightning. Even though you don't need it, but there you go. All right. Let's keep on moving. The sky is radiant this night. I feel it. What is that? What is that? Wait. Oh. Take this. <clears throat> oh shit. Guys. Might wanna help me out. Burn you, bruh. Oh shit. Look at this! Look at this! Oh wow. <laughs> Did you see the guy? He went up, then came down and slapped me across my face. Hey, don't grab her. Leave Jinx alone. Hey, Jinx. Here, Ashlyn. Ow, ow, ow. <coughs> oh, my God. Oh, my God. Help. Oh, hell no. I'm going to heal. Get off, I'm coming. Come on, man. Come on. This is too long. Buff my dudes. Yes. 
Yes. Woo. Follow me, if you would. Hold on, wait, wait a minute, man. Come here. Come here. Make a camp. <laughs> Maybe not. What you got for me, brother? Where are they? Where's everything? What are we here for? Totally forgot why we're here. Tis this way. Oh, you've come to a dangerous place. Scaly beasts make this their den. We've been dispatched to cull them. Mm -hmm. A small force ventured inside, though I've seen neither hide nor hair of them since. Seems the battle is hard won. Okay. I'll not stop you if you wish to explore, but don't look for my aid if aught goes awry. You want me to go in there? All right, let's go. Fine. There's a haze over my eyes. Can anyone hear me? We need help. Where's my teammate? Come on, I don't man. To fall here. Let me just put that on because it doesn't look like my people wants to help me. Me out the way, please. Here we go, another bug. Bird. We are under attack. <laughs> oh. Nice. Tremendous work. Tremendous work. Definitely, bro. Definitely. What up here? Come on, guys. I grant your weapon a magic. The prison has been drenched. Oh no. Drenched, I tell you. Why is Ashton jumping down? Oh, there's another one down there. I didn't realize there was another one. We must strike boldly and with presence of mind. Understood. Tis done. Splendid. Oh, another black chest here. word of this to Captain Brown. I believe I can guide you to the person in question. Can you? Do you believe so, my sir? Yon path leads not to our destination. If you would prefer to explore, I should guide you another time. I'll find my magic path and spell more quickly. You do a lot of that when you're a mage, man. So much. I'll collect that. You needn't trouble yourself. Okay. You haven't gone this way. Hello, hello. Anybody here? We're just running around the cave. You attack faster. My nice. Thank you. Oh, well, oh, fairy stone. Beautiful. Indeed. 
We're gonna clear out this cave before we even decide to leave, because you know how this game is. We'll never come back here. You're not one of ours. Have you come to save us? Well, it looks like it. Forgive me. I cannot seem to walk of my own accord just now. Would you aid me in reaching the entrance? Okay. Right, so I have to grab you. We need to... <laughs> Water is nigh invisible in this gloom. No few times is an overconfidence. Oh. I wonder if this is actually worth going. I don't think so. Step soaked my boats. Ah, I'm still gonna be curious I though. Expect that's a common Hold fast, oh, shit. Arisen. I will be with you in but a moment. I just dropped him on the floor like that, man. Come on now. Here we go. We are at the entrance now, brother. You can climb this. Come on. Come on, dudes. We out of here. You went in there to save my fellow soldiers. Well, now. Yep. I underestimated you, friend. I shall send word of your deeds to the captain. You've done well this day. I oh, thank you. We'll see to the rest of this mess. You need not trouble yourself further. All right, brother. Look at him. He's coming up. Jigs, give me that um, cape, man. So I look better. Oh, no. Let's go. Hold, sir. I'd rethink pressing onward if I were you. The village is crawling with Saurians. Forgive me. I didn't mean to startle you. I used to call this place home, you see, in times more peaceful. Hmm. You're the Arisen, are you? Well, that's something. We were hoping to reclaim our village, but it doesn't seem we'll have much luck. We fled when the dragon attacked some days past, thinking we'd return once the baleful thing was gone. Easier said than done, clearly. In our absence, a bask of Saurians have made our homes their own. We can't have that, can we? Careful now. Saurians, master. Oh my. The deed done good arisen. Looks like it. Oh thank you. Thank you. We shall all be able to return to our homes at last. I can hardly wait to bring these tidings to the other villagers. I dare say we'll have this place livable again ere long. Okay. I cannot thank you enough. Long will you be known as a friend to our No village. problem. If you happen to pass by do come visit us, won't you? I will. I should like for you to see this place as twas afore the dragon's attack. Wait a few days and then return to her village. Still. Oh, so Just much shit on me. Tidbit I heard from the locals. Say, you've got a decent arm on you. Yeah. And no need to be humble. Just the other day, I watched you fell a massive monster with my own two eyes. I've never seen the like. Okay. Pray, sir, teach me to fight like you do. I'm after an instructor, see. But the ones in this city are cravens all. The sort that decided to teach to avoid the battlefield. Right. If I'm to grow stronger, I need to learn from someone who's seen actual battle. A real warrior, such as yourself. Won't you give me a chance? No, but I know someone who can. Tell him about Baron. And this Baron fellow. He's a real warrior. Yeah. I suppose you wouldn't recommend him if he wasn't. And after all, I've seen your prowess. I'm inclined to trust your judgment. Mm. Many thanks, sir. Methinks I'll seek out this Baron and see what he can teach me. Sure. Beautiful. There's a ladder here. We ought to put it to good use. Yeah, we do, but I also need to go sell some stuff. Yeah, let's go find Captain Brent. The person we're here to meet is nowhere to be seen. Shall we come back later? Yep. The current hour ill suits our progress. Let Hail, friend. Have you a spare moment? What now? I've an eye for people, and my instincts tell me you're of trustworthy ilk. I'm in a bit of a quandary, you see. I'm to be gone for a week, with no one slated to mind the house in my stead. 
Fear not. I only ask your name to list as a tenant. You needn't bother yourself with the cleaning, and I don't expect you to stay cooped up in there, neither. I'd be much obliged if you'd simply consider my home a waypoint on your travels. Sound appealing? Then come on by and have a look-see. I've taken the liberty of marking the location on your map. Right. Over here, if you please. Wait, wait, man. Um, you think we can find that little boy? We meet again. Hey, boy. Truth be told, I was hoping we might. Really now? Okay. Would you care to stay and talk a moment? Sure. I'm glad. Sit down, won't you? I'm rather fond of this place. I never imagined a city could be like this. So full of excitement. So alive. And how could I have? In all my life, I've hardly left the palace. My mother is quite strict. You understand. Oft did I long for a taste of normal life. Oh shit. Even aught as simple as going shopping for myself. Are you the queen's son? My mother has always procured the things I covered for me, so to pick out an item and obtain it with my own hands held a certain appeal. Of course, in the end, you were the one who made the purchase. I got my dude over there. Waving. That's all right. I know you meant well. Besides, I can safely say it was still a novel experience. I wanted to give you something in return by way of thanks. Here, this is for you. My apologies, friend, but I'd best be going. I mustn't let Mother find out I left the palace. Right. Thank you for indulging me. I, I do hope we'll see each other anon. Till then, farewell. Farewell. This might be worth a read. Let's have a look then. Thank you for the Jasper. I feel like we should change to Sorcerer. Weapon skills. Here we go. Full blown sorcerer now. Now we just need to wait for night time. So we need to sit on a bench. So where's the closest bench? There's a bench right there. Hey dude. We did it. Greetings. We finally did it, man. Have you a moment to speak? There is much we ought to tend to. If we are to strengthen your majesty's claim mm -hmm. as a true arisen. Right. You've done a fine job calling those monsters, your majesty. Tis common knowledge among the people that t'was you who delivered them from danger. Good. The number of those who seek out this tavern in the hope of an audience with the arisen grows by the day. Right. Should you continue to display such valor, the day will soon come when Disa can no longer deny your presence. Okay. Here, it slips my mind. Pray, take this. Tis a symbol of my own gratitude. Well done, Master. Ooh. By your efforts, our time Let me see this cloak. I'm gonna wear this cloak. And then, I'm gonna send this cloak to... Jinx. Let me see how I look. Let me see how I look. You've called more than your fair share of monsters. Tell me about the Queen's region. You will need to infiltrate the palace to gather evidence of Deezer's misdeeds. I hesitate to ask something so dangerous of you. Yet I fear we have few other options. I have attempted to do the same through my own channels of for now. Though I have yet to uncover so much as a whisper of her plots. Would that I could undertake the task myself. But my station prohibits me from reckless action. What say you, your majesty? Might I ask this task of you? 
Sure. I shall ensure that the door to the Queen Regent's office is open between midnight and dawn. Pray use that time to conduct your investigation. Of all those who serve the Queen Regent, there is but one who I have no doubt will lend his support to your majesty's cause. I refer to Waldar, a magistrate. Okay. Many a time has Deza demanded Waldor amend the Code of Vermont to her own benefit. And many a time has the magistrate refused her, for he is loyal to none but the spirit of the law. As our laws dictate that your majesty is our rightful ruler. Thus, as the staunchest supporter of the law known to the palace, I'm quite confident that Waldor will be willing to vouch for your majesty. What say you? Might you be willing to aid me in arranging the magistrate's release? Yeah. I've prepared a means for you to enter the palace dungeons. Pray, take this. This mission demands the utmost secrecy. Pray thee be cautious, your majesty. Should you be discovered, I will be unable to lend aught in the way of aid. All right, guys, so I think we'll leave it for today. We'll see you in the next one.